y'all have to come look at this i have the first ever full lace wig and when i say full lace i mean you can part it down the center without that pesky cap it is full lace let's jump right into today's wig i'm gonna show you exactly all the things you can do with this new style let's get into it Let's jump into the unboxing from this wig from AF Sister Wig. So in your box, they give you a wig cap, they give you an edge band, they also give you some eyelashes and a lot of other goodies. Let's get into the cap construction for this wig. This is a full lace, meaning the center is not that material that it don't look like scalp, it is all lace. I did add lace tint to mine because I didn't feel like bleaching the knots. I mean, but if you was to bleach the knots on this wig, it will completely look like scalp. But as you can see, it also come with combs and adjustable straps in the back. So you can also use the built-in adjustable straps to do a glueless install. What we're gonna do today, actually, we're gonna do this glueless and I'm gonna show you how versatile this wig wig is the hair color today is a color number two this is a 20 inch straight wig and as you can see this hair is gorgeous straight out the box it is full from root to tip the density is 150 which makes it perfect for styling and everyday wear now you know before we get to styling we have to make sure that this cap is going to fit so make sure you are getting a size that fits your head but not only that you want to make sure you get rid of this ear tab area correctly so that your wig can fall around the ear when doing your styles as you see the seam right here that's where you're going to start cutting it is where the ear normally fall on your head so you want to get rid of this area it'll be like cutting a u-shape and when you do it that way before you install your wig you definitely will get the perfect fit around the ear it's time to install this wig and before i get into the install i really miss adding my own custom touches to the wig so i am going to tweeze the hairline to my liking and how i think it will fit me so these are little things you can do if you want to you don't have to because the hairline on this wig is absolutely gorgeous as you can see already so i'm just being a little extra here and i think it kind of makes the wig look better when you just add a little extra to it so remember you can do this or you don't have to it's optional by the way this wig will be linked below in the description box and yes i will put a discount code for you guys down there so be sure to check below hairline is looking fabulous and it didn't take me hours to pluck just a few strands to take out and it looks amazing so i'm going to push it back with this hot comb and then we are going to get into the install for the parting i'm going to do a slight side part just because i feel like it'll make the wig look a lot more realistic and i'm not going to touch it too much with the hot comb just enough to open up that parting because i like the volume today we're using my sticky little secret melting spray only this is not going to give you hold but it is going to melt the hell out of that at least <laughs> the spray and wig will be linked in the description box i'm going to take some scissors and add two slits to the lace and then i'm going to add that melting spray on the hairline dry it for a little bit so it's not too runny and then lay that lace over top next we're going to dry it just a little bit more and then use this little brush and we're going to pull the hairs up out of this because we don't want it to look messy we want it to look nice and clean after that take the edge band lay it down and let this sit okay Okay, this is a step you do not want to skip and let it sit for 15 minutes. Let's back it up for a second. I forgot to tell you guys how good this lace is. AF Sister Wick has the best lace. As you can see, it blends really good with the skin, the hairline. You can't even see it. Like even right here where I'm pointing, the lace is there. I'm going to show you a close up how good this lace is. And everybody always wonder if it's going to be too dark, it's going to be too light. With AF Sisters Lace, it is clear. So it's going to show whatever skin color you have, it's going to show that. So clear is clear. There's no color to it. It's just flawless, okay? And it melts really good. 
once you cut away the lace if you happen to get any residue all you have to do is take a little bit of the product itself and wipe it around the hairline you can use the brush you can use your fingers just make sure to clean it up so what we're going to do this year is we're going to stop letting our edges get stuck in those glue we're going to take a brush and we're going to fluff it out so we can have a more realistic look it gives the wig a more realistic look when you take little steps like this just to reassure that the hairline looks natural also getting rid of any pieces of lace that is visible now for the best part styling this wig this wig is so versatile you can do almost any style you want especially since the cap fits perfectly with the whole full lace without that stretch material in the center you can part this wig anyway i'm gonna show you guys that in a second but the styling options are endless with this particular wig you can pull it up you can pull it down you can part it down the middle you can part it down the side whatever you want to do you can do look at that hairline it looks so good the hair is performing very well this is a straight style so of course you won't be able to curl it and get it to stay completely but you can also get this in a body wave too they do have that option on their website stay tuned because we haven't even gotten to the best part i'm going to show you how this wig parts down the back All right, so this is how you can wear it straight out the box. If you just add a little bit of layers to it, parting, wig looks amazing. It don't even look like a wig. Like, I'm gonna stop calling it a wig. I wish there was another name, okay? Because this just looks amazing. Okay, let me show you the parting in the back. So as you can see, you can part it all the way back and the color is going to be the color of whatever wig cap you're wearing because that center is now invisible. So you can see the actual wig cap and as you can see it also lays flat in the back there's no bulging and like i said the parting is endless really fast i'm going to show you a couple of styles you can do so i'm going to do like a half up half down style i'm going to part it all the way back to the center of the cap now it's hard for me to part the back of my head when i can't see it so if it don't look perfect it's okay I honestly would recommend styling your wig off the head because you can then see everything you need to see and make it perfect the way <laughs> you want it to be. But for now, we're just going to work with it. Okay. So yeah, we're just going to work with what we got going on. And remember when you're creating your styles, the less product, the more realistic I feel like the hair can look. Also check out my previous video on reasons why your lace is showing. So if you have problems with that, definitely check out that video. I have lots of tips, but as you can see, the parting is phenomenal. If you were to bleach the knots on this wig, it would be 10 times better. But for me, I'm just doing a lazy girl thing. I use the lace tint and that is it. And I do have on a wig cap. Here is one of the styles that you can do. You can do so many styles with this wig. The options are endless. Also, just to show you all how flat the back lays and also that the cap fits really well, I'm going to go ahead and just style this in a low ponytail. You can do a high ponytail if you would like, but because adjustable straps are in the back, it probably won't look as good as if you were to take them out or if it was the invisible strap. For the most part, it is workable. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> so I'm just smoothing the hair back again. I'm not using any product. I just kind of smoothed it back, put it into a low ponytail. And as you can see, looks really good on the side. The ear tab area is perfect and the back looks good also. Again, this is why you would like the 150 density because it is comfortable. It is going to be that density you can wear every single day and you can get the most realistic look with it. But yeah, I like the low ponytail. It gives every day like this style is just gorgeous by itself. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. I gave so many details in this video and don't forget to check out my previous video about blending lace if you are having trouble blending your lace. This wig will be linked below in the description box and yes, you can use the code Marie to save. I will also put that discount down below in the description box with all the products that will be linked in my Amazon link in the description box that I used for today. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you back in my next video.